Norton is one of Australia's oldest wineries and is responsible for one of our largest selling and consistently popular white wines. In 1937, the legendary Jack Mann first made a wine he named Horton White Burgundy, and which soon became the wine that made the rest of the world take notice of WA's potential as a producer of fine wine. Today, Horton is WA's most awarded winery. Chief winemaker, Rob Bowen, and his assistant, Ross Pamant, are finalists in Gourmet Traveller's 2008 Winemaker of the Year. For the same reason that sparkling wine can't be called champagne if it's made outside that French region, the white burgundy is now known as Horton White Classic. We've had to change the name to, to white, white Classic, white classic but the wine's exactly the same and the blend is very much the same as what it has been over the years. It's a wonderful little wine that you can put away and age for, for, for many, many years. So Which is something I definitely didn't know. And this is a, a 1999 museum release. It is. It's based on Chenin Blanc um, with a bit of uh, Vidalo, Chardonnay, Semillon and a uh, little secret thing is Muscadel. And this is, this is the same wine that was put into bottles, you know, uh, in, in 1999 and was going on the shelves as, as the white burgundy of the time? Yes, absolutely. And as a tribute to Jack Mann, Horton has released the Wisdom Range, featuring some of his favourite sayings. One of the great things about being a winemaker and, and making wine is that no two years are the same and it's always a challenge to, uh, to get the best out of the fruit because another one of Jack's comments that I always believe in is that being a winemaker, you're really only a, a custodian of nature and you, can, yeah. you can't sort of push wines in any one direction that they don't, don't want to go in. Down, 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 down.